he was a restricted free agent. What is his status right now, Adam? Well, the good news for the Steelers is that no team signed him to an offer sheet by Friday's deadline. The bad news for the Steelers is that Mike Wallace has told some people within the Steelers organization that he does not plan to sign that restricted free agent tender until he has to. And that means that when the Steelers go to training camp, if they have not structured a new long-term contract for Mike Wallace, that he may not be there for the start of camp and they may be without him for a little while. It doesn't sound like he's in any rush to sign that $2.7 million tender. He wants that long-term deal. He's determined to get it. And it doesn't sound, based on his words and some of the things that he told people within the Steelers organization, that we're going to see Mike Wallace in Pittsburgh anytime soon. Eight touchdowns, nearly 1,200 receiving yards last season. That would be a big loss for that Steelers offense.